Hello my dear family members, I have information that many of you have take my assessment within very few days and the coding doubt is going to be held in just after the assessment. So let's discuss about a coding question which was asked on 2020 and again repeated multiple times on 2021. So before I show you the questions, let me give you thanks to everyone for subscribing and making Technology of a family of 3000 members. Hope you will keep supporting me as always right so let's discuss the question so the question is build a program for calculating and returning the sums of absolute difference between adjacent number in arrays of positive integers this must be calculated from the position determined by the current user for example suppose the total number of elements is 5 and these are the elements 1 2 3 6 4 right then if we decide to start from the third position or center uh, 3 as input the function will occur from 3 the third number in the array right so uh, what uh, they are telling that we will have total 3 inputs right one is the number of elements of array and the second input is all the elements of array and the third input is from where we will start adding elements right so after taking the inputs what we'll do we'll just start from the from the 3 minus 1 index right we'll start iterating uh, the array from 3 minus 1 index up to up to what okay let's uh, see the example so here we are adding 3 minus 6 at first sorry 6 minus 3 at first then plus 4 minus 6 right so what we are doing that is from here we are iterating from here to here actually right uh, why because we have to add array i sorry array i plus 1 minus array i and then again array i plus 1 minus array i so we have to iterate up to length of array minus 1 right so i hope you will understand uh, understand after writing the code okay let's see the next example so actually here the output is 6 minus 3 plus 4 minus 6 and this is absolute value so output will be 5 right and in the second input as well so first input is the number of element 7 and the this, these are the elements of array 1 2 3 6 4 6 3 and the from which index we will start count uh, will start adding that is 3 this is not actually 3 index this is actually third element right this is third element but we have to iterate from 3 minus 1 index right so from here okay so uh, what will be output that is 6 minus 3 that is 3 and 4 minus 6 that is minus 2 so this is this will be absolute value so 3 plus 2 plus 2 plus 3 right so 3 plus 2 that is 5 plus 2 7 plus 3 that is 10 so output should be 10 and uh, we'll have to uh, manage to to be the output as 10 right okay so uh, what we have to check at first that is uh, array elements should be positive right okay i will not check uh, if the element is positive or not i will take uh, random elements okay i am giving you the task to take input only positive right hope you will do so so let me write the code and let's make it more clear to you okay so let me import a file import java.util okay i'm importing all the classes under util package okay so we'll have to take input so we'll have to take uh, declare the scanner class object scanner sc is equal to new scanner and call the system dot in method and let's uh, declare the number of elements in is equal to sc dot next int sorry and let's uh, declare the uh, array name that is let's say array is equal to uh, in, sorry new int and the size that is n right okay now from which index sorry from which uh, element that is sc dot next int okay 
so from this uh, index minus one we'll start adding the element right okay let's take the input for array elements okay so for int i is equal to zero i less than error dot length i hope you know how to take array elements okay so we'll store all the elements from the zeroth index of array so sc dot next int okay okay fine so array elements are taken now what we'll do we'll just start iterating from from minus one index up to array length minus one index right okay so let me write it and it will be more clear int i is equal to from minus one index right okay so let me copy this one two three six four we'll start iterating from this index right so let's say the input is three so we'll start from three minus one index right and we'll visit up to this element because we will have to add array i plus one minus array i right so for that we have to visit up to array dot length minus one right that means in this case array length is five and array length uh, five minus one that is four so zero one two three four and we, ha we have given a less than a sign so we'll visit up to this so this is not inclusive right okay now i plus plus okay now what we do we'll store the values in a variable called sum right so sum for that we have to initialize the sum variable sum is equal to zero right to store the values so sum plus is equal to we'll store array i plus one that means so we are starting from here right so we'll add this value minus this value plus this value minus this value right so for that we have to add array i plus one then minus array i after that we have to take this as absolute math dot absolute value right so this way we are adding the values i mean adding the adjacent values and uh, getting the absolute value okay now let me just print it sorry system dot out dot print ln sorry and let me just write it sum okay okay so let me run it and see if this is right or not so the first input was sorry there is a oh sorry spelling mistake so this should be capital right okay so the first input was the number of elements is five and the elements are one space two space three space six space four and output should be five sorry oh actually uh, the mistake is we have to take the from variable after taking the array elements right that's why this is giving mistake i mean this is giving error okay now let me take the size of the array i mean a uh, number of elements are five and elements are one two three six and four right and output and, and from which index minus one that is three and output should be five as expected right okay let me run the second input that is number of elements are seven and the array elements are one two three six four six three right okay from which index minus one that is three and output should be ten and this is as expected right so i hope you understood the logic and syntaxes i used in java so if you have more efficient code then please let me 
no and give your code in the comment section and if you want python solution then please let me know in the comment section i will try to give you as soon as possible and don't forget to share the content and subscribe this channel and watch the playlist regarding tcs and qt tech mahindra or accenture and or cognizant as your wish so thank you for today's session